Welcome back to King 5 News at Noon. The kids in today's A Family for Me, you've met them before back in 2015. They're siblings who can't imagine being separated from one another, but that's exactly their situation right now because they're in different foster homes, still waiting for that forever family. Maybe you can help. Here's King 5's Joyce Taylor. Stand on the bar. I got you. Are you gonna help have the water too? They've grown since we last saw them two years ago. You scared? Look, ready? Watch me, come. Go, go, go. And the bond between them has grown stronger too. It's hard not living with a sister that you've had over half your life. Ten-year-old Kimani and the youngest, Karma, live in a separate foster home than their older sister, Kimaija. And since I've been gone, it's kind of been really hard because I'm moving around and stuff. They make the most of their time together, sharing stories, playing games. These times are precious, and they know it. You can talk to her about stuff, stuff that's happening at school and stuff. He's really funny, and he has a kind heart, but he, you could talk to him when you need him, or if he's feeling down, he cheers you up. They have a lot in common, a love of books and school, food and art. Both are creative and artistic and adore their little sister. She speaks like her own language, and she has her own world. Karma, now eight, is autistic, and she is very close to her siblings. So what's the perfect home for these three? Well, the answer to that is simple. A home that has, like, um, feeds us stuff that's healthy, that takes us to the doctor, and actually loves us. They have to be kind and and except all three of us, they can't just take two of us or one of us. They have to have all three of us. Boy, let's hope that all those three kids can stay together. A family that could take all three would be preferred, but their social worker will consider two separate families, provided the kids can maintain that close connection. To learn more, just uh, go to WACAP. That's the uh, World Association of Children and Families. The number's on your screen right there. Um, it's 1-800-732-1887. We also have a link at king5.com.